Happy New Year everybody, glad to be back. Uh, I hope you guys were able to spend some time with the family once again. Uh, this kind of concludes the uh, the uh, holiday festivities, Thanksgiving, Christmas, now, or sorry, any holiday you celebrate in December, uh, mainly, you know, happens to be Christmas and then the New Year kind of caps it off and um, of course, you know, I had to do a, a little New Year's resolution video. And uh, I do like to uh, to do resolutions at the beginning of the year. I know sometimes it's kind of a, a meme and a joke. But it's actually kind of sad that, you know, nobody takes it serious. It's not about, you know, being a New Year, New You. But, you know, have some goals in mind try to accomplish some things throughout the year it's good to have that you know in the back of your head going into new year you know maybe <clears throat> things don't always go your way every year and just good to have a nice little a mindset towards you know what you want and what you want to accomplish so um you know happy new year to everybody hope you guys are doing good and uh i hope to hear your new year's resolutions by the end of this video um right here you'll see uh, with the gameplay, man, I gotta talk about Caldera for a little bit. It is in complete shambles. <laughs> the <laughs> Warzone right now is just horrifically bad. Um, I'm sorry I have not been able to get any good gameplays whatsoever. Uh, or at least <laughs> stable gameplays. I shit you not, I think I've probably lagged out one out of every five games and I know that doesn't sound like a lot but once you put that on my teammates also we have a lag out one in every two to three games uh, I, I, it, it's ridiculous you know I've been I've been having some time you know to play with my usual trio Te Texas Tony Tiger and, and DeSaint uh, even Hayes and Hey Snipe and uh, you know I've had time playing but Jesus Christ we just lag out it's ridiculous and what's crazy we all have PS5s and PCs like <laughs> it is it's been horrible the the Call of Duty team was on vacation it, I, I am really frustrated right now uh, I have not dropped a penny this uh, this year or this season at all whatsoever even starting with Vanguard, I have not dropped anything and I do not plan on to. And I don't plan to as long as, man, these people are still uh, not on top of their game. You know, I do believe there's a lot of promise and they can um, definitely correct a lot of these things. Um, the invisible, the, you know, there's an invisible skin right now. <laughs> He's literally running around invisible, that 100 skin while they're on vacation it it's really frustrating i'm uh, sorry i have not been able to get no warzone gameplay what we have here is one of my favorite uh game modes that ended up coming out towards the tail end of verdansk is uh, iron trials and oh man so I, I get like six kills the seventh guy technically died in the gas but he would have been my kill anyway uh but you know iron trials is a little bit more for the for the top for the elite uh, a lot more ha health, slower regeneration, uh, money's harder to find, kill streaks, and the whole buy station's harder to buy things with increased prices. Uh, one of my favorite game modes, so I hope you guys enjoyed this one. I did have this one stored for a rainy day like this, but we also do have much more gameplays um, that uh, I want to show. And I do want to say I will be posting other games that I'm playing uh, I did want to record myself playing Resident Evil Village just because that's like a scarier game so uh, I am gonna be posting my full playthrough of that game probably an hour 45 to hour segments 
Um, and I'm also playing It Takes Two with my girlfriend, so that's actually kind of fun. Uh, might have to get her a new mic because <laughs> she cuts, sometimes she cuts out, but you know, at least as far as videos, that's uh, what we're kind of getting into. So uh, if you like everything video games and just talking about life and different topics, please, please, please hit that subscribe button and join the souls. I would appreciate that a lot. But on to our New Year's resolution video. I do kind of have it structured here as to the uh, topics I do want to cover. So uh, I do have a, a little layout here of what I want to talk about in my resolutions, but let's just get started. One of my first New Year's resolution um, is my health and my eating habits as well as going to the gym um i feel like i've gotten uh, a little off track when it comes with that and um health is one of the most important things to me um it's just you know sometimes we lose track of what we're eating and uh you know get into a habit of eating out a lot not going to the gym um and all that stuff to me is very important, especially towards my uh, my mental psyche. You know, I can feel myself. Uh, I'm not happy with myself right now. Uh, I do want to get in a little bit better shape, especially knowing I have been in way better shape. Um, and, and the thing you'll see here that is very uh, that comes up a lot is consistency uh, with all these things. It's all about being consistent. Um, you know, making better decisions when I. You know, go to break at lunch, break and lunch at work, you know, on my days off when it's easier to, you know, <laughs> go and get something on the street, you know, being mindful of that. Uh, the gym, I just need to get back at it. <laughs> I, I do have a membership. I've always had a membership and um, that's within my reach. have a gym almost right across my house, so there's no excuses and there shouldn't be excuses in any of these. <laughs> so uh, that that's a... Uh, one of my main top things that I want to put out there. Um, next is my YouTube channel. Uh, I feel this is a, a good time to really start putting some, you know, uh, guidelines and kind of some consistency also in my upload regimen. Um, I do want a new video every two weeks. I think that's perfectly um, doable. I could definitely do that, um, you know, whether it just be my playthroughs or, you know, Caldera gameplays, you know, sometimes I might have to put out a second, <laughs> a second video, you know, within a week, um, but I do want to do that. Like I said, uh, I'm going to have a lot more gameplays than just Call of Duty, uh, Resident Evil for now, and uh, it takes two with my girlfriend, which hopefully we can find more two-player games so we can, you know, <laughs> both record and, and play and show you guys. And um, also my goal this year is uh, 100 subscribers. If I could do that, uh, <laughs> that would feel great. Um, I know uh, I do start need to make, I need to start making more um, uh, videos that kind of reach a wider audience in order to accomplish that goal. Uh, for instance, I do have one video just on my controllers that I did not post. Uh, on my social medias, you know, and to my friends, because I thought that one would gain its natural attention, and to this date, it is my most viewed video. Um, and that's because a lot of people are trying to look at um, the best control settings, you know, for games. And I still need to do one for Caldera because I only did it for Vanguard. Unfortunately, Caldera right now for console does not have FOV, so um, I could hold off for that a little bit, but. You know, I do want to reach 100 subscribers. I will be trying to look at videos on how to do that a little bit better. And that is one of my goals. Um, the next thing I want to focus on is my relationship with my girlfriend as well as family and religion. Um, these three to me all go hand in hand. Uh, sometimes we forget, you know, family's not around forever. Um you do have to um you know be there for your partner as well as you know they're th as well as them being there for you like they are for you um 
I feel it's very important to have that family time, you know, every now and and, and then. Um, spending more quality time with them, you know. It is part of uh, kind of not focusing too much on yourself and, you know, forgetting you do got a family that you care about, that care about you. Um, and, you know, <laughs> it's crazy every time, you know, sometimes we don't want to go to that <laughs> family gathering. And when we do, I always... Uh, I always end up uh, not regretting it <laughs> at all whatsoever, you know. It, it is always good to uh, spend time with the family. So I definitely want to want to try to emphasize that too, as well as go to church. Uh, I should be getting more Sundays off, so hopefully I'm trying to make it a priority to, to go to church. Uh, I am a man of God. Um, I think I mentioned that before. Um, just something that, you know, I should give back in general, staying humble. And being thankful for life. Uh, so that's number three. Uh, number four we got here is uh, looking for a new job. Now, I did recently get a promotion at my current job. <laughs> but to me, it didn't uh, feel like a crazy promotion. It, it, it does feel good, you know, to, you know, be a little bit more in charge, have more responsibility. But, you know, in my eyes, uh, I was already doing a lot of that stuff. <laughs> I just have the title now. But uh, besides that, uh, I would like to do something that interests me more. Don't get me wrong. Right now, I am in retail, and uh, I've grown accustomed to it a lot. Um, I can handle uh, anything that has to do with retail. I feel like customers and inventory, uh, I've grown accustomed to it, and it's really, it feels really natural to me. Uh, I'm not pressured too much, and... Um, the only downfall is that, you know, it's not something that interests me to my fullest. Uh, you know, sometimes work is just work to me. It's not something that I want to go to every day. And uh, I feel that is a problem. Uh, so I do need to complete and update my resume. Uh, I do got cousins <laughs> that can help me definitely uh, get it out there. So uh, that is still lingering in the back of my mind, trying to find this new job. <laughs> Um, or finding a new job that I feel fits me more, my interests more. And, um, yeah, that's a, a big summarization of everything that I got. Uh, the only thing that uh, I was going to lead off with this, but I decided to put it to, at the end because to do all this, one of the most important things that I have to basically do and that's time management um whenever people have come to me for advice uh, as far as things like this it, it's always been time management i think it's very important to know what to prioritize uh in your life and you know yeah. what you're trying to do because uh you know time is limited <laughs> every day and uh it sucks because you know i want to be healthy i want to do youtube i want to spend time with my girlfriend and family i want to look for a new job and i want to sleep too <laughs> so i mean it, it sounds heavy but i've i've done it before i know we all can do it uh definitely do it if we really focus on it and remember you know we only have a certain amount of time every day um as well uh, as that i'm including in this is is uh just getting general enjoyment um, from things and uh, I had to it's hard to explain <laughs> the enjoyment aspects because you know sometimes you know we take for granted certain situations or certain time spent and uh, we forget that we should we should be having fun or getting enjoyment out of what uh, we're doing whatever that may be you know whether I am working on my YouTube videos whether I am hanging out with the family or whether I am at the gym um, we, we might need to if you're not gaining enjoyment out of something we might need to uh, take a step back and look at sort of what is the issue as to why you're not gaining enjoyment but you should so like let's just say I'm working on a YouTube video and I find myself thinking about like man it's a drag <laughs> to do this then you know I'm probably not doing something right or it's not for me unfortunately now I can say right now I can't wait to do YouTube videos um when I get the chance so I know that's not an issue for me you know so uh 
That's the last thing, time management and enjoyment. I am going to ask one thing of everybody, and that's to please let me know what's your New Year's resolution or resolutions. And if you don't got any, at least some goals that you have in mind for the new year. Uh, you know, what you guys are doing, what you guys are up to, what you guys want to accomplish. Um, I'd love to interact with you guys uh, uh, and hopefully motivate you guys to uh, want to complete those things because uh, definitely got a lot of videos on uh, motivation and things as such. So uh, thank you guys very much for your time. Please, if you guys have a chance, hit that like button. Uh, helps out the channel a lot. And... Um, I wish you guys the very best 2022 that you can possibly have. Uh, I know great things are in store, and if not, I know we can overcome anything uh, that might get in our way this year. So, thank you very much. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Go down or stay up? The fucking guy is just standing over oh, us. Oh, the other dude's over, dude. Somebody fucking airstrike him. Oh, what the fuck? Mark, 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 look at me, look at me, look at me. Oh, shit. Mark, to my right side, Mark. Mark. Oh, dude. No fucking shot. Oh, my God. 2v1, okay. The other guy's in the barrier, there you go. He has to move, he has yeah, to move yeah. without cover. Right there, right there. Oh. Oh. Did he die? He died! Oh, he died! Oh, again, dude! <laughs> oh, that game last year. Bro, that team was fucking garbage. Oh, I can't believe you clutch that. Oh, dude. I was gonna say, just hold them off until I can res, dude. Oh, oh dude. And you collapse them, dude. Wow. Wow. Fucking AK, bro. Told you. Look at that prestige too for the calling card now or what?